Hello everyone, this is X88 Pro 13 Android TV box. You can purchase one of this for around 15 to 20 pounds. This is the um, upgraded version of the previous one, which is was which was the X88 Pro. It has slightly better features built in. It has the same design to be honest. So let me go through it. So on the left side of it, it takes a micro SD memory card, two USB A ports. Um, when you switch this on, this bit will light up. On the right side, there's nothing really there. At the back, it takes a DC port. It also takes a SPDIF port, HDMI port. It also takes an Ethernet port and an AV port. Now, it does have a lot of ventilation, so it doesn't overheat. It's got rubber grips on each corner, so it doesn't uh, move side to side. And it's good the fact that you got a Ethernet port because you can use it either connect it either by Ethernet port or you can use Wi-Fi. Ethernet port is better because it gives a more stable connection without losing any or having any interruptions. Where Wi-Fi sometimes it can have interruptions middle of watching a film or something. Now along with that it comes with a HDMI cable, comes with a three pin plug. You can also get a two pin plug as well. It comes with a user manual and it also comes with a remote now this remote has a lot more f uh, functionality um, YouTube button Netflix button home back um, number buttons go back um, uh, on and off and it requires two uh, AAA batteries to operate this um, uh, Android TV remote along with that it does have a, a few great features packed into this so it operates on Android 11 um, operating system um, the chip that he has built in is um, rock chip 3528 uh, you can get in different specs by the way so the che the cheaper one would be the 2 gig ram 16 gig internal memory Th this is the one i've got right now and then you can get the more of the expensive one which would be the 4 gig ram and you can choose between 32 64 or 128 gig so that's the more of the higher spec one so you can run more faster you can you can operate with more apps running on this android tv box um it operates on 4 2.4 gig and 5.8 gig wi-fi and it also has a built-in Bluetooth 5.0. It supports up to 8K output. And it also has a 3D visual effect as well built, in, built into this Android TV box. Um, it may sound too good to, too good to be true. Uh, because the price range of this is only about uh, 15 to 20 pounds. And the fact that it supports up to 8K output. Uh, that might not be the case. It might say that. However, I think it can... Uh, it supports up to 4k in my opinion uh, trying this out and so le let me get this up um i'll show you exactly how it looks on the tv screen okay so this is the home page of the x88 pro 13. now this is the layout it's um, screening on a um, 65 inch tv crystal clear um when it comes to video quality it's not um exactly 4k it's got probably a more of a 1080p resolution um but that still does the job if you're going to be watching youtube or netflix etc um this is the home page so we've got gallery chrome youtube music play store my family cinema your calculator media center clean up file browser google aptoid aptoid tv disney plus air screen so you can screen Things from your t um, smartphone to the Android TV, compatible with Android and iOS. There should be air screen, there should be MiraCast as well for that. And if you go, um, there should be an option uh, for you to add more um, apps. If you go to Play Store, download other apps such as BBC iPlayer, um, um, ITVX for example, or for example, uh, you've got a few other ones that's not here. Um, paranormal um, uh, Pluto TV etc there's a few that you can download the settings at the bottom you can also connect Wi-Fi and you can connect Ethernet cable to give you a stable connection but this Android TV is perfect it's a very a smooth operating Android TV bear in mind that um, depending on what specs that you buy if you download too many apps it could slow down the Android TV so thank you for watching my video please do give a like and subscribe